record here because I'm on so many systems. All right, here we go. All right, we're recording now. So let's. So I do this so many times, but there's different paths. So I'm going to try it this way. Let's see. So you go to SVN, check out projects from SVN. I'm going to create a new repository. All right now, it wants to know the URL. So we went to the URL, which is here. We're trying to get this generator. So I get this URL. Yeah. Put it in there. See, it has CDG, so that kind of looks right. Okay. Okay. Connect this up. I'm going to click that and say finish. Okay. Okay, cool. So, so first of all, that looks good, right? Does that make sense? Now, yeah, you, no. now you got the next hard part. Now that's not connected to NetSuite, right? So what we got to do here is we got to get this connected to NetSuite. And here's the tricky part. Let's go find the system in NetSuite, right? So we know this is an ETM dev. Is that right? Uh, yeah. It, yeah that, that makes sense. Okay, great. So let's just make sure we're centered to understand yeah. the um, where it is located. Right. Oops, let's go to the document repository. Yeah. So don't be in a folder. And we got that one right there, there correct? Yeah. yeah. Cool. All right, great. So we now know where we are in the tree, right? And so we go, okay. All right, so now let's go over to back here and change project settings. And here's ETM dev. Good. Mm -hmm. Now notice it thinks it's this. Well, we know it's not. Yeah. So this is a little slow but it should bring up the tree for us and we at least know where we're going. So let's have a look. Cool. All right. Oh, there we go. And then go here, right? And it's right there, right? And now, right? If we look, it looks clean, right? And if we wanted to just double check because we think everything's synchronized, let's just do this just to make sure we'll compare with the file cop copy, right? That we know we are at least talking to the same thing. Okay. There we go. And from what I can see, I don't see any, everything looks clean, right? That's probably pretty straightforward from that perspective, right? If there's an existing repository. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, definitely. 